evening and welcome to the John Report. I'm John. Here's my report. Husky defensive lineman Steve Emptman announced this week that he will turn pro next year. Emptman says that he'll miss the UW, but plans to purchase the school as a memento at the end of his first <laughs> NFL season. Well, two kids from Bellevue admitted doing a drive-by shooting with pellet guns. They said they were getting back at a guy who sold them some bad frozen yogurt. <laughs> Michael Jordan has asked the NBA to stop using his likeness on all league merchandise. Following Jordan's lead, Dan Quayle has asked to have his likeness removed from jars of Sunny Jim peanut butter. <laughs> this way, okay. Right there? Fine, okay. A UPS professor says that this is the decade of the brain. Coincidentally, a Wazoo professor announced that this is a decade. <laughs> Snohomish County will be adding fluoride to the water next month. In a related story, the city of Kent announced their plans to supplement their water with Budweiser. <laughs> the Washington Redskins will appear on the new cover of Boxes of Wheaties. The Seahawks will appear on Boxes of Nut and Honey. <laughs> Government regulators say First Interstate Bank's Mercer Island branch won't be allowed to open until First Interstate improves services to low- and moderate-income customers. In an effort to help defuse the situation, First Interstate of Mercer Island recently lowered the price of chiclet gum near the door from five cents back down to a penny. <laughs> well, a bill proposed by the state legislature would make it illegal to join a gang with the intent of furthering the group's criminal activity. However... It still would be legal to join a gang in order to coordinate their charity drives and bake sales. <clears throat> Finally, there will be a meeting this Tuesday at the Renton City Hall to discuss two possible futures for downtown Renton. Residents will be asked to choose between a bulldozer or a few cases of dynamite. <laughs> this has been the John Report. Thank you, and we'll be right back.